everybody. How are y'all doing today? I hope you're having a good day. I'm having a good one and I uh, just wanted to bring this to your attention. We're going to talk about maybe going off road with our Aptera for a little fun ride in the country or in the mountains or on a dirt road or something like that. And as you can see here, they got the equipment where you can actually order that. So we are going to get into it. So let's get started. Okay, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me. We're going to talk about doing some off-roading. And of course, if you're on a regular dirt road, you know that you have at least five inches of clearance on the Aptera and about not eight, nine inches of clearance from the ground to the belly. So what would probably be the best way to do that? Well, we know that the Aptera, it can uh, do some interesting things. And what I like about this shot right here, where it's showing that they are actually taking the beta out on the road and doing a number of tests. And it's showing you what the beta can actually go through. And we know that they've actually upgraded Aptera since then. So they're doing acceleration tests, braking tests, quick turns, um, doing a moose test. And uh, so they're checking the high stability. Uh, they're checking the steering. And, you know, this tells me that uh, it looks like you can have a lot of fun doing some off-roading with this thing. And so another thing about the beta is, okay, it doesn't have the wheel skirts on it on the front or on the back so for me i would probably just take those off if i'm just going on a regular dirt road off-roading and just take the front and rear skirts off and then just have at it on the dirt roads and you know just to have some fun right there so you can actually take it like that and ride through the a dirt road with no problem without damaging any of the skirts for the wheels since it's all wheel drive. And uh, that's probably what I would do if I was going off road. And that way you don't have to really damage anything. But it looks like it would be a lot of fun to do that if you wanna go off road and uh, that would uh, be a lot easier than trying to do it with, with all the skirts on it. Uh, of course, at Terra, I mean, they have a really nice suspension and they tested their suspension on a lot of road track um, races that they did and uh, moose runs. And of course, we want to, uh, I mean, some of y'all are going to get out there and y'all are probably going to do more than just ride through the dirt. You're probably going to ride through uh, mountainous rocky area which um, you probably want to get the kit for that they have an off-road kit where it will raise the suspension and you could probably do all that and of course you want to get all-wheel drive uh, you don't want to get your app tear out there and get stuck and so it would probably look very similar to this and you can see how high up that is. And uh, this even puts lights on your uh, wheels so you can see what's in front of them better. But I mean, the road that he is on, you can see that's pretty rocky. So you definitely want that suspension to lift the vehicle up higher. 
And of course, no doubt, you're not going to be worried about, you know, range when you're out riding in a dirt road area like this. Uh, you're basically out to here just to have fun and to kick the Aptera around and see what, what it can handle and what it can do. Uh, the suspension looks pretty sturdy, so I believe you'll be able to get through a lot of rough terrain, especially with the all-wheel drive, so... I don't think you'd have any problems, you know, out kicking up dirt with this. Of course, I don't think it'd be bad when you're out using the, like if you don't get the upgraded kit and you're just on a dirt road, like back here, see if you're just on a regular flat dirt road, then just taking the skirts off, you shouldn't have any problems with that. Uh, but if you're gonna go through something, some rough terrain like this, um, you definitely would want the off-road kit from that Aptera supplies. So what do you think? I mean, are you gonna do that? Are you gonna take the Aptera off-roading and see what it can do and kick up a lot of dirt and dust <laughs> like as if you were in a truck? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And if you're not, I understand. Um, I'm mostly gonna use mine for just a regular commute vehicle. Uh, going from work to back and uh, just try to save on as much power as I can. But uh, of course, every now and then I am going to take some road trips. And uh, who knows, I may, if I got time, I might go to a good favorite place that I used to drive through and maybe take the skirts off and throw them in the back of my Aptera and then just use that um to ride on the dirt roads uh not real muddy mud pits or something like this or terrain like that because uh, i'm pretty sure at terra may not be able to go through all that but looking forward to your comments uh let me know what you think and um we will see you in the next video and i know you're gonna have a lot of fun in your app terra when you get it and I know I'm going to have a lot of fun. I can't wait to get mine. I'm going to enjoy it. And if you're new here, smash that like, ring the bell, and hit subscribe. And you'll catch my next videos when it come out. Uh, of course, we got some new exciting things that are happening with that Terra. And uh, very soon we'll be talking about all of that. All right. Y'all take care. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.